welcome. Krishna, we've freed all the souls. It's over. So you have. All of the souls have returned to the flesh. Now, even the full moon will not hatch the cosmic egg. But full moons come and go. I have not given up on salvation. You don't know when to quit, do you? Humans die and reincarnate over and over in this world. This is the axiom, which cannot be overturned. But it is you, the God of the Covenant, who is turning this universe into hell. He created this universe himself, and then made it the crucible for human suffering. He claims that those who survive the suffering will be saved, so long as they submit to him. And so he created Lucifer, to deceive them and prolong their suffering. One does not lose their way solely through order, and one does not suffer by entrusting themselves to chaos. Only with the order of angels and the chaos of demons do humans lose their way. Humans are bound to their covenant with God. They depend on him, submit to him, and suffer humiliation. But this covenant is not the only way. You have been tricked into suffering without love. I will never stop trying to bring you salvation, for my salvation is born of love. Are you seriously saying love is the reason you killed so many people? Fed their souls to Shesha? It's merely a step on the path. By becoming one with me, the souls will be free of the cycle of reincarnation. Humanity will be saved by joining a great singularity. Except none of us want that! Least of all from the likes of you! I understand you may not care for me. But do you speak for all mankind? Flynn suffers so much from his incessant, heartless meddling. But my love will overcome his suffering. He will become my god slayer. I will not rest until I have achieved my salvation. I will not rest until I usher salvation and create my new universe. And I will slaughter all who stand in my way. You've fallen so far. I fear my compassion may no longer reach you. But, on the dawn of my salvation, surely even you will understand the meaning of my words. For now, I must be your enemy. There's no hope for humans. 
Humanity's only chance at salvation is through me. Yeah! 
To think he would retain so much of himself after fusing with me. I would expect as much from my Kalki, but inside this cosmic egg, I am the truth. I am reality. You cannot destroy me! I will continue over and over until I save you all. Isabo! Navar? Give Flynn the katana! What? And why are you green? Just do it! Over and over and over! You will know my salvation! Flynn! But... I am the only one who can save humanity! <sighs> humanity will save itself. You are supposed to be no more than an illusion! How could you defeat me? My new universe! My salvation! It was all just a feeble dream! Glad to have you back, Flynn. Thank you, Isabeau. I didn't mean for things to get so out of hand. Yeah... You really know how to make me worry.
fishing hook. Huh. This belonged to Isakar. Thanks. Thanks, everyone. Because of you, I was able to come back to my senses. If Krishna could use me like that, I still have a lot to learn. People called me their liberator. But who have I really saved? That nagging guilt created the opportunity for Krishna to take advantage of me. Guilt? That's something I'm far too familiar with. Navar? Yes. Green, floating, but still your fellow samurai, Navar. Wait, now everyone can see Navar? I suspect they couldn't see me because I didn't wish to be seen. I didn't have the heart to face them after what I did. Twould seem I unawaredly hid myself from them. The lingering emotions of the dead take form as ghosts. I guess the shame inside Navarre was so strong, it hid his presence from others until now. <laughs> Pretty deep. For Navarre. Yeah. Who would have thought he had a sense of shame? Are you making fun of me? I'll have you know I played a crucial role in Krishna's death! That's a good point. Who are you, and what have you done with Navar? Truly, what phantom is this that haunts us? Oh, come on, Gaston! Ah! Over. No. There's one last thing we must do. You're right. Well, let's get it over with. It's your show. Wield Ame no Habakiri. Here's the very heart of the Cosmic Egg. That will bleed it of its power. It's finally over. No more Lucifer. No more Merkaba. No more Krishna. Things can finally go back to normal. No, Asahi. Life won't be the same as before. It'll be even better. Yeah! Guys, maybe not the time for celebrating. Whoa! What's happening? We should run! 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 Indeed! Retreat! Let's go, Nanashi! <laughs> <laughs> 